Hey guys, uh, so Nick Lee just posted a video of the uh, Windows 95 booting on the Apple Watch and uh, it's a really cool hack but I thought, uh, you know, it's strange uh, that he said it takes one hour to boot because today's ARM chips are actually much, much faster than yesteryear's, uh, you know, 486 is running Windows 95. Even accounting for the overhead of emulation, there's no way that it should take that long to boot Windows 95 on an, an Apple Watch, I thought. So um, I have an ARM machine uh, that I figured I could quickly try this on. Uh, here's a uh, Samsung Chromebook, and this is an ARM V7 uh, you know, instruction set CPU, just like the Apple Watch. Uh, this is a 1.7 gigahertz chip, dual core. So what I've done is I've lowered the CPU frequency via software scaling to 500 megahertz, uh, which is uh, close to the Apple Watch's 520 megahertz, and I've turned off one CPU core to make sure we're not cheating by running, you know, the OS on one core and the emulator on the other core or something like that. Um, so this has now become a 500 megahertz ARM box, uh, which is comparable to the Apple Watch. The CPU here is probably a bit faster clock per clock um, than the uh, Apple Watch, but not that much. Um, and let's see how long it takes to boot Windows 95 on this machine. Let's full screen that. So it's starting off pretty quickly. If you remember Windows 95 at all, this is, uh, uh, you know, they, they certainly took a couple of minutes to boot at least on real hardware. Unless you had some kind of screaming fast PC. And it's past the boot screen. taking a while to uh, probably initializing video or something like that. There's a mouse cursor. Looks like I have a uh, scaling issue. Oh, there we go. Still a little hourglass. Oh, and there we go. So, uh, yeah, that's uh, if you were counting, that should be about 90 seconds. And uh, this is actually quite usable. It's not, you know, it's not going to win any speed contests, but, uh, I mean, you can certainly browse around without feeling like this is... Uh, you know, extremely sluggish. It's 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 slow. You know, it takes a while to uh, refresh windows and things like that, but uh, not hair pullingly slow. And uh, it should be capable of, say, running a web browser or something like that if I bother to install the network drivers. So there you go. That's uh, Windows 95 on a 500 megahertz ARM Chromebook. Um, not that bad.